What's going on, y'all? Yesterday, I missed my first day <clears throat> of, um, you know, the video logs. You know, I didn't, you guys didn't miss much, honestly. Um, the day before, I ended up going out. And we are out pretty late. It was, it was a right time. Just hanging out with my girlfriend and her friends and all that, but... You know, it's what it is. It was, it was all right. We ended up getting home at like 2, 2.30. And I passed out. And I didn't wake up to like... Fucking, uh... What? 12. So, and then the entire day, I spent on social media. So, not much was missed for you guys yesterday. Um, but today, woke up, went to church. Um, yeah. Half the day was spent productive and half the day was spent in the zombie mode. Um, but <clears throat> luckily I finished out the day being productive, so that was good. Um, yeah, so ended up getting my clothes done, all the stuff I usually need to get done for the start of the week. Um, so yeah. Uh, there's, there's a brief time in between, like 1 to 5. Uh, in the morning I got my clothes done, did homework, and pretty much planned for the week. And then in between that and when my girlfriend came over, and then um, ended up on social media, beating off all the negative stuff. But yeah, I definitely have to strengthen my mental fortitude. Um, I've gotten way softer over this past week when I've done nothing. I've noticed that. So the gym's going to help with that and just uh, having the right attitude with life and not accepting comfort and pushing past comfort into discomfort. That's going to help. Um, so, yeah. So how's that? Um, I'm going to try and make these videos a little more better. Um, you know, um, they're pretty pretty basic. These are just video clips uh, strung together in iMovie, not even uh, clipped or any, like edited or anything like that. So yeah, I'm going to get better at that. And yeah, I'm just going to go into the week with a new game plan. I'm going to be working from, I'm going to start my day at, uh, you know, 6 a.m., and then till 7 p.m. And from there, I'll have my free time to do whatever. So, yeah. We'll see how it goes. Um, going into tomorrow with a good mindset, good attitude. And, you know, just recognize this comfort and not avoid it. Accept it and try and move on and um, tackle it as soon as possible. So, that's the mindset I'm bringing into this week. Um, yeah. Turn 11 p.m. About to go to bed. And wake up tomorrow, so we'll see how that goes. Um, you know, look, things are looking up, feeling good about the week. Um, yeah, just looking to put last week behind me and uh, learn and just continue to grow and move on. Um, you know, these video logs are for you guys. Um, a side note is that um, while I was out, you know, people were talking to whoever my girl, like the like uh, her friends and everything. One one of their boyfriends. He works for HVAC or whatever. He's making a hundred and thirty thousand dollars a year, or upward. This I'm not even sure if it's hundred thirty, but at least six figures plus a year. That's my age. So and then I know he can do the same thing, honestly, and probably thrive. But I don't know. Like when I hear stuff like that, it makes me torn between. Want to work a job like that, but I don't know. I just don't feel like it's my path, really. I don't know if that's arrogant to me, but I just don't feel like it's it's meant for me, you know. Like I could work, uh, you know, my dad could probably give me in as alignment, electricity, and all that, and I'd be making pretty good wages. But I just I don't know if that's what I want to do with my life. So yeah, so I'm torn between that, like. On one hand, it, it'd be nice to make that much money and be set or whatever. But on the other hand, I don't know. I just want to, I don't want to go living my life thinking, what if I would have took that chance to run a business and end up 20 years working the same job. And I'd have a lot of money, sure. But I don't know if it's what I want to be. And I'd have regret. So I'm going to take the chance with this business. And uh, yeah. And instead of looking at the business as a way to, you know, earn high amounts of money or uh that be like money focused just take each day and work in creating a better product and just 
that should be my main focus with the business is creating a better product, a better service, a better, uh, you know, everything for our clients and everything like that. So, you know, I'm making a bigger difference. So we're making a bigger difference on people and providing more value and making a bigger impact on the aquarium industry and all those things. So, yeah. Um, and then doing so, money will come organically. Uh, my mom always said that, you know, follow your passion and money will follow, you know, or do what you love and money will come, you know, don't worry about it. So, yeah, uh, that's what I'm going to try and do. I'll also bring that mindset in. Uh, it should help me with my nervousness with uh, speaking to people about the business. So, yeah. Anyways, guys, I'm rambling. This video has been six minutes long. Um, you can, again, be better at the editing and all that crap uh, this week coming up. So, yeah. Checking out here, guys. Remember, believe in God. Believe in yourself. Give 110%. I promise you, you'll be happy with the results. Um, you're on this journey with me. And I promise you guys, you're going to see big things, Ed. Whatever it may be. But anyways, guys, checking out. <clears throat> Catch you tomorrow. Peace.